guys coming up on five seconds. Okay, I'm Tom Paran, and this is Speaking of Golf. This is Speaking of Golf with Tom Haran in association with the PGA of America. Now, here's your host, Tom Haran. And welcome to Speaking of Golf, America's number one internationally syndicated golf radio show, airing on News Radio 570 WWNC and 1400 to Peak, and streaming live in the U.S. with our partner, SportsJourney.com, and in all of Asia on AsianGolfMonthly.com and AsianGolfDaily.com. I'm Tom Horan. So glad you're with us today. We have a fabulous show. We're going to go ahead and open up the phone lines. Number one golf instructor, according to Golf Digest, and Butch Harmon. So nice to have you on Speaking of Golf, my friend. Pleasure to be with you. Well, I know it's a little early for you out there, and I know you're on vacation, so I want to thank you for taking a few minutes to, uh, to be with us. Everyone today, like you say, is so enamored with distance. That's all they care about. They care about they swing, want to swing as hard as they can in case they hit it is the way I like to say it. Good point. If they would spend more time working on their short game, their golf scores would improve. And then swing within yourself. Know your capabilities. Know what you can do and know what you can't do. All right, my friend. All right, there's uh, hour number one. We're going to have to take a short pause here on Speaking of Golf. When we come back for hour number two, it's even going to be bigger and better. Don't go away. Absolutely can. And here's what you should do, Tom. You should take a page from Rayo Ishikawa's book, and you should go out and buy yourself a red belt. And I'll tell you what, no matter what you're wearing, you know, if it's beige shorts and a blue shirt, that red belt would just make the whole outfit pop. And, you know, in, in, in this kind of an economy where we're not going to go out and buy a whole new wardrobe. Sometimes just buying a fun accessory like that just really puts some zing into your outfit. Marty, you said that uh, once before we had you on about the white belts and it draws attention to the waist and you've got to be uh, less than 36 inches. What about the red? I, I think that the LPGA right now, from a talent perspective, is is as strong as it's ever been. Obviously, with the makeup of the tour, they have to look globally in order to capitalize because there's no question that American players are quite simply getting outworked right now. And, you know, so that acquaintance, that person that you don't really know that well, um, you, you, you don't offer them advice, certainly not unless somebody specifically asks you for some advice. And even if they do, you do it very quietly and you do it once. Uh, it, it, the course isn't a place to be changing your swing and trying to fix things. That's the practice area. On the course, go out and have a good time. Hey, I'm Tom Horan. Thanks so much for listening to Speaking of Golf, and we'll talk to you again next week right here. Bye-bye, everybody.